Ah, there's another one. That was the point seven. Oh, hello there, fellow teenings of the Teening Army. I'm the Gaming Teens in your storm, and as you can possibly tell, I'm essentially, uh, we're doing a little bit of some cleanup here. Tell what I'm doing is I'm going through areas I've been to before. Let's be seeing if there was anything I may have missed. Any cuties, any pickups, stuff like that. Could be just something this way. Ah, there was something I missed here. Gabriel. I killed her. Undermandine told me to. I killed one of the concubines. But why? When she died, she smiled at me. And at the life seeded from her lips, though I fore for to continue her fight. I would let anyone above we were wrong on the Manhattan. All of this is wrong. Nephilim, I know why you are here. Each infant form is above. It's in the air sip. I'm sorry, but I can't let you have it. I've fallen in love with a corpse. All that's left for me is to carry out her will. I never know her name. This word is all rotten. But we're still alive. The last two men on this wretched world. My name is Gabriel. Whoever dies today, remember their name. Let's go on. So this is an upgrade to the... Nope, I can still have the pistol. Oh, well, the red carpet, why don't you? Keep forgetting to turn that off. Wow. Okay, guess there's nothing over that way.
I mean, I'm gonna try to find the, uh... I have no idea what you are. Go ahead and heal up. You're here. The blood and dirt and mud. The full blood and dirt and mud. You crawled your way here. For Eve. <laughs> I'm sure by now you know what happened. Under Mandine's sins plagued this land. And once you hurt her, this will all start again. It is not better to have this world right away to avoid making the same mistake. I've made my choice on that matter. I won't let millions die again. I won't let men like Undermantine be born into this world. I won't let you have Eid. Undermantine, the mass sneezing, and you, all of you are so selfish. Dragging that poor girl back into this nightmare. If you want her, you have to get through me. As that, uh, what is that? About the comment on a particular stuff, uh, Anyway, the machine gun here is a significant upgrade from the... Very basic. So it looks like it's just gonna try to slash at me. Oh my god, that did a lot of damage to me. That uh, thing I see you on your leg, that better not be what I think it is. I better not get flagged for the side of. <laughs> the path to under Manhattan has been op opened. I'm done at the air sip. Oh, now it opens up. Okay. Just need one.
back to count. did oh it opened up a door Waited so long for today. I wanted to die for so long. Everything that happened is my fault. And do you think I'm happy? Do you think I wanted this to happen? Do you think I l like being what I am? My 
hate myself. Anything I've ever managed to do is destroy, destroy, destroy. Again and again. I couldn't save anyone. I couldn't do anything. I'm just a horrible but disgusting monster. So tired. If this world wants me to be a monster, then fine. I'll be a monster. A demon. I'll... Nah. Destroy every last speck of life in this world. I'll ruin everything until there's no one left. No one to remember my sins. No one at all. Seems to be pushing them back. Just judging by, by the amount of folks out there, I'm gonna keep the god mode on. That's a gun! He has a fucking gun! <laughs> Not for him. Take the blade and end my life. I'm bound, it's bound to my soul. Killing me will bind it to yours. I can't do this anymore. I can't run away from the truth. I'm awful. I'm a pitiful man who thought he could change the world. But with each step, I just made things worse. Bombatorium came to us, but not for ease's sake, but to punish me. So kill me. Once I'm dead, this world's curse will be lifted. If it works, then maybe it wouldn't have all been for nothing. Nephilim, when I die, who will be I remember as? I'm sorry. I'm just gonna do a quick save here. Under Manhattan is dead. You have Seraphim and Eve. You are where Under Manhattan was many years ago. But you will not fear where he did. Soon this world will be changed forever. I suppose my purpose is fulfilled. With this I can finally die without regret. Now for him, I shall give you one final boon. Go. The future of this board is in your hands. I'm guessing through that thing is that... Um, there was something on Steam I saw. Yeah, um, this thing. The 
Go ahead and take a look at it. Just to like check on a few things here and there. So what you're going to essentially see is me going back uh, to other areas I've been to. And essentially what I'm actually going to do is... Checking uh, like for various uh, things here and there. Gonna make it a little bit of a. Yeah, and apparently I missed uh, one of the totems over here. That one I missed. Okay, that one, I know I got that one. Yeah, I know I got that one. That one I know I got. Because I did see that, and that was like in the first uh, video. That one I went back for. I did get that one. Was there another one? In a pilgrim's, uh... Or did I get this one? I keep my... You're pretty well watching this as well as me, so... Don't be too surprised at that. This is just me, like, making certain... And, yeah, I did get that one. That's another one I got. Remember the, there was another one in here? Okay, so there was another one that I missed in uh, Pilgrim's Way. Apparently. What's... Let me just take another look. Okay, so that's where that one is, you say. And then the next one is... Okay, so I got... So there's that one. Okay. Okay, it was where I was going for... That was totem seven. Okay, so that one I didn't miss. Okay. Oh, I missed one over there.
Yeah, I see it over there. Okay, so that one I got. That one I believe I got. Yeah, I did get that one. That was so that's up to nine. Next one of course was under here with I did get that one. I missed one there. Okay. I did get that one. That was one that I did see. And then, then that should open up. Now that I've gotten all of those. Yep, I got him. The milk of nuns seeps into every orifice. From your stomach up to your soft get fingers clawed to escape your teeth. Heat of the twist around your hands. You have acquired the Eldritch Annihilator. Wait, isn't it the thing from flying? Okay, I guess I got that. Alright. Guess next up is the Homunculus Quitters. Oh, and apparently I missed one at the beginning, apparently. I'm gonna go and, uh, get that.
Yeah, that one I missed, which would be seven. Right, that's seven. Yeah, now I got that. That was the first one I found. That was two. Ah, and I missed one over here. That's eight. I did get that one. So far I got eight. That was another one I found. I'm not so certain about that one. So... No, I did not. Okay, so that means I now have nine of them. One more. I'm in this area. Okay, now that one I did get. That one I found. That was another one I found. I did find that one. That was another one I found. That one I found as I was uh, going into the airship. Looks as if I do have everything in terms of I do have it, okay. Oh, tender my children, back here with me, safe and sound. You've done wonderfully. I must continue my studies, but here, take this weapon. It is a bow weaved from the fibers of mortis lilies. It's a do you well. Oh, 
Oh, I had nuts. Uh... That's everything there. Uh, let me just block here. IDDT. IDDT. They're not gonna let me do IDDT. But I'm just going to, since we say that, uh, I believe I got pretty well everything that was that I can get in the game, as far as I know. Oh. Uh, in terms of the uh, person there that I just saw, uh, this guy right here, uh, Pagby666, uh, thank you for putting these two guides on here. Now, granted for the most part, I found most of them by myself, but in terms of you essentially... Um, finding like everything for us, I should say thank you pretty much for that. But, uh, thank you pretty much for that. Now... Three point three hours. Uh, as for the last three collectibles, I don't know where they are. I'm not gonna bother trying going out of my way to find them. Anything like that, but I did get the main collectibles. Which was of course the Eldritch Annihilator. And the I'm trying to think here. Oh, he's uh Back to where I was here. Right, uh, All right. Ah, uh, what? Not the uh, Majora's Mask here. Oh, there we are. 
You've done good. And the man I was an impulsive self-loathing fool. Yet you released him. That was punishment enough for his sin. You have Eve and Seraphim. I am Barbatorium. You are the Nephilim. Let us settle this as you have countless times. Okay, the music does not fit this. Okay, the, the music does not fit this at all. This is actually creepy. You have a lot of health. Okay, don't do that! That actually scared me. Am I? Wait, am I doing the enemy about five damage to him? Okay, he's at. You've got teeth. I suppose my work here is done. Have me eat and sell them. I will bind them together. The souls trapped in the blade will feed into Eve. From her, life will flourish once more. She will born again, a queen of angels in the Garden of Eden. Eve, your wrath is complete. Let's start over again. This time, we get it right, okay? <laughs> content is not fun kid friendly so there's that and that's it I guess um, that's it I will say um, just pretty well based off the demo from what I uh, had there was a really, really great demo, really great, uh, Doom Mod play. Now granted, yes, I realized that, um, I did pay $13 for this, essentially. I did pay $13 for this Doom Mod. But, this Doom Mod was really, really good to actually play. Uh, Scumhead, they up at yeah, there you go. I know I didn't get every single kill in the game, and I know I didn't find every single secret.
Um, the main thing that I guess you could say were the main big secrets of the game was of course the bow that I got and the Elder Annihilator. Which for some odd reason takes embiotic batteries for some reason. Um, in terms of, uh, I don't know whether or not it does because of the way I have my graphics set up or whatnot on this. Or not that I couldn't necessarily see the map with the... There you go. Didn't necessarily see the map with the uh, place that was in there to get cooked down to Eve. Eve's uh, thing now. But uh, regardless though, I did manage to get through that. Uh, the weapons uh, were pretty much what I expected to. And yes, I know I did uh, cheat on this. Uh, starting with when I, mean, I got the Fecco Soul. I don't know why it didn't work. I mean, we don't know why it worked. It could be I, um, screwed something with that. I don't know, but the, uh, no clip mode was, did allow me to actually be able to, uh, play for the game, uh, normally as I could. So there was that. In terms of, uh, I guess you could say, everything else. I will say, you made a really, really good game. Uh, thank you, pff, scumhead, for actually making this. I really, really did enjoy actually playing through this. Uh, in terms of... I guess you could say, the main game. Main game was actually pretty good in terms of like the metro style um, of going like from one place and then it interconnecting to another place. I really did enjoy that. Uh, the bosses were okay in a sense here and there. Uh, I did find, now granted, yes, I did have the... Um, coaxing on there, but I kind of found uh, Under Mannheim a little spam happy with the gun. And I, of course, did um, say like my own little rant about spam happy bosses when I did Records of Lotus War, D-Lit, and Wonder Labyrinth. I did uh, talk about my, why I don't like it when bosses are pretty or very spam heavy. So there was that. As for uh, everything else about the game, excellent design. The weapons really felt really good. Uh, and here and there, especially considering that I did get an upgrade to the shotgun to get a sawed off. And as well as also the a couple of, um, well, one secret, one boss that uh, was optional here and there and whatnot. As well as also, of course, the two secrets that I got. I really did enjoy that. Also, I think the Eldritch Annihilator is a reference to uh, your two games that you made, which was Shrine and Shrine 2. And if you want to check those out, go right on ahead. Uh, I do have a playlist. Look for the playlist and you'll find both of them there. Uh, main thing I pretty well got to say is pretty well... Uh, thank you, Scumhead, for making a great Doom mod. And uh, Now, I know this is pretty much your fifth Doom mod that you have made. And at some point, I will play Like and So On and Like and So On 2. I will play both of those probably with codes here and there. But that's just depending on what it's going to be. Um... The music was actually pretty good. I did like the music here and there. Although, the ending music, it really, really didn't fit it. Because it felt... It actually legitimately felt a little... Shall we say... 
unnerving. Cause it literally, me, it sounds like almost like children's music. Almost like one of those music scenes where you're supposed to feel sad. But it just felt, it legitimately felt out of place. Now, it did actually give me a couple of good, uh, some three, three times it got me pretty good. One which was a new enemy, and a couple of other times were for a couple of attacks. One that was on the airship, and one that was uh, for Bombatorium's skull attack, which did give me. Both of those did, all four of those actually did give me a good bit. Regardless of all that, as you can possibly tell, um, other than that, I really, really did enjoy actually playing through this. Uh, again, thank you to, of course, uh, PagB666 there for uh, sewing a couple of, uh, where you can find, like, any of the uh, totems and the quitters if you manage not to know where they are. Thank you a good bit for that. Um, if you want to actually see that, just look at the, um, the page where, um, if I can bring it up here, like this right here, scroll down, and you see these two things right here, that's where those two things are. But as you can already can tell, uh, thank you, pretty much a good, pretty much thank you, very much scumhead for making this game. Uh, there was something that I was looking forward to to uh, eventually uh, come out this year. I really did enjoy it. I, I don't even remember when the last time I actually did the demo of this. I don't remember when I did it. I think it was like maybe a year or two ago. I don't remember. But uh, from this, like from the mod that came out like the demo that came out, and this is also made by the same person who made Twine 1 and 2 and like and so on 1 and 2. Regardless of all that, thank you, Scumhead, for making such an excellent game. I know I'm pretty much rambling on and repeating myself. So I might as well do my outro here. Thank you so much for watching my playthrough here of Bombatorium, a Doom mod made by Scumhead. Subscribe if you want to check out other videos. I've done in the past or to stay tuned for future videos either on games or even even do mods such as this in the future. Comment down below what you said thought of this game game or if you have another game or mod you want me to try out on the channel be sure to let me know down below. Until next time stay 20% cooler and I'll see you in the next video, my friends. Bye-bye.